Okay, so in this video, I wanna help you out if you've got a Canon camera, how to focus it remotely. Uh, I've got a camera at the minute that's two and a half meters away from me, and uh, because it's a Panasonic, I'm able to do it by using an app. I can touch on it and focus, I can hit record, I can start it going, and I can see that the feed's coming through well. Uh, I can't do that on a Canon, can't do that on a Nikon, don't even think I can do it on a Sony. It's why I love this camera. But if you've got a Canon, uh, do not despair. There is a way of doing it by using a cable. Um, so let's get into this. First of all, go off and look for EOS Utility download there it is um, it'll take you off to the canon website and you type in your camera the model of the camera that you've got and then the computer the operating system that you're on uh, i've just done this but do that it'll do a download um, let it come in open it up install it all right then come back to your camera so all you're doing this is the cable that it came with a usb cable um, i've just had to put it through an adapter into this new mac if you find that uh, this isn't gonna take you far enough away, then you can get an extension, literally just a standard USB extension that's got a female, uh, so you plug your USB in at one end and it's just extending the lead so it comes through to the other end. Uh, and that will get you the distance so that this camera can be back over there. And then look what happens. I turn this camera on and uh, it automatically brings up for me the EOS utility software. Uh, if it doesn't, then go off into your uh, applications and find the thing first of all uh, and let it load up. But I'm on here, it's already loaded up for me and it says remote shooting. I can tick that as an option. And then it shows me this panel over on the side here. This is really the display off the back of my camera. And down here is what we want, live view shoot. And straight away, let's just pull this window up bigger. Uh, that's just given me a view of my camera. Now, at the minute, it's really dark, okay? But I can go into this and look at this. I can actually change the settings of my camera from here. So um, I can put this on to something that's gonna work. There we go, now I can see myself. Um, that's really cool. So from my computer at the side of me here, I can adjust all those settings. So I can adjust my shutter speed, my aperture, my ISO, um, I think I can even do the white balance. Yeah, I can, look, it's up here on an auto white balance at the minute. And so with my camera out of reach, I can't get to it, I know I can in this case, but um, it, it, my camera's over there. And on this screen here, what I can do is to move this around. And um, when I double tap on it, that will focus on me. And then when I'm ready to go, I can hit the record button uh, down here and it is now recording, uh, how cool is that? All right, so um, that if you've got a Canon camera, that is absolutely the best way for you to get going. It means that you need to have a computer in front of you or you know, to the side, um, but it's a, it's a fantastic way for you to actually focus it, check all your settings and hit record uh, from the full screen of your computer sitting at the side of you. It works on Mac and PC. Um, have a go at it and uh, let me know how you get on. But that really is a fast solution. So um, yeah, Kate, that was one for you. Uh, I hope you found that useful. And uh, yeah, keep an eye out for more videos.